Hello my friends and welcome to what I think might be a long video for Power Wash Simulator because we have to clean the washroom and I think this is a big one. I think it's a medium one. I think it might not be as big as the treehouse but after the treehouse maybe we don't want to be doing something that's going to take forever anyway. But this is going to take a while regardless. It's not going to be the longest but it's not going to be the shortest. How's that for vague? A vague description of what this level will be. We'll get this entrance cleaned first. I love that it's like some sort of like completely sealed off dungeon bathroom. I think there's windows actually. Yeah, actually it's very well illuminated with windows. Some of them are just filthy. That's the problem. So maybe not so much of a dungeon. Now, the question is, do I start off with the floors? Do I do the ceilings and the walls? Do I do... I guess those are the only real options for the large parts here. I guess we'll just do all of it. We'll just treat it all as one big tube that we're in. A washroom tube. Well, yes, there are lights here, too. That's a good thing. That's weird, that has not dinged yet. What have I missed? What? Oh, oh, never mind. It's done. Just lacking patience. You know what, maybe we do the floor first, because then we can just do this. Oh, you know what, that's actually working fantastically, so maybe this is the... Oh, never mind, I lied. I've lied to you, and I've broken this trust. We were leaving streaks everywhere. Oh, there's footprints. Is that for me? No, that's not possible. I don't think I can leave footprints. <laughs> Otherwise, I'd be able to clean a place just by walking through it. Or mess up a place. No, I don't think I can make footprints. I don't think my feet exist in the world. We'll get this little hallway done first. Man, I'm running out of English lately. Just can't speak. I'm just tired. The thing that's funny is that the videos that I've recorded during this play session will all come out at weird random times, so you won't even know that there's any connections. Those reflections are trippy. <laughs> so yeah, tunnel wall. Okay, there we go. Tunnel snakes rule. We're almost done the tunnel wall. Which is also the tunnel ceiling. And the tunnel tiled floor. Tunnel floor? Tiled floor? Ah, whatever. It's all clean. Doesn't matter. Alright, this is the sink area. I think I might need to go for yellow here. It feels like I'm just leaving little scuffs behind and becoming a chore to have to go and find them again to tidy them up. This is a disgusting bathroom. See, I don't understand the lore of how this bathroom got in this state, because we know that there was a tornado or whatever, right? But that was outside. <laughs> how did it bring all the dirt in here? Am I too big to fit on top of these sinks? Yes, that makes this a little bit more difficult. I have to find new creative angles to, to reach these sinks, the inside of the sinks. I think, well, oh, that's not very good. I can't reach that one. You know what? I'm just going to hope that by cleaning the rest of the sink, that will ding. And then I don't have to deal with the little splotch inside. Uh-oh. Oh, never mind. That one went okay. This one might not. Yeah, I don't know. Not feeling the confidence here. Oh, that one was okay. I think there's just a lot of dirt in this one. It's, I don't know how to clean it. Aside from doing this weird jump, maybe? Oh, there we go. Thank goodness we did it. It's a light. So these are... urinals, but they're massive. Look at this. When do you ever see a urinal this big? It's like a bathtub. You know what? The windows are easy, so let's just bang these out real quick. 
So then that also gives us the illusion that there's more light in here. And you know what? Why don't we do this opposite? Whoa, this tunnel's filthier. This one's worse than the first one. This one's got moss growing in. I feel like this was like an abandoned bathroom, maybe. We could go multi-purpose soap. I just don't know if we need to. Floor down. Now we gotta get the walls slash ceiling here because it's a big arch. I think we can leave a little bit of scuffed marks here and they'll just disappear on their own. We don't have to be perfect here because it's such a big area. There's less moss now, we should be able to go white. White nozzle. Big nozzle. 45 degree nozzle. Whatever you want to call this thing. I just go by their colors. <laughs> Maybe I should have done better. <laughs> it's still a mess in here. That's okay. Progress. We're making progress. But I did leave a lot of spots. Which might make this just a little bit more difficult to finish. Because we're going to have to go back and tidy up. Yeah, there's the obvious ones. That, that's okay, though, because they're obvious, so we can make them disappear. Whoops. There we go. Alright, that's both tunnels down now. This has rust on it, so... Oh, that's not going to do it. Metal cleaner, maybe? Maybe we take care of all these all at once. Do we have any metal cleaner? No, but it's not expensive. Let's just buy the one. Let's buy two, just in case. Yeah, that feels like a smart investment. That feels very smart. Because there's a few of these, and they're all rusty. Anything else that we can clean with this last little bit? Has to be metal. I don't think there's anything that's urgently in need. Oh my gosh, look at this terrifying thing. But I don't think there's any metal here that's really bad. I guess I can spray this pipe. All those window frames. There we go. Uh, these little urinal knobs. <laughs> what are they? Is that where the water comes out? I don't even know. We might buy some multi-purpose cleaner. I'm not sure yet. We'll see how things go. For now, we'll just use this gray. Gray? Green? Oh my. <laughs> oh, we're doing terrible here. Let's go to yellow. There's just so much mold in here that's getting stuck. And the skylight frame is... Rusty. Oh, this is where we should have used our cleaner. Let's do it. That's nice. That does get done pretty quick. Don't know if I'm going to have enough to do them all, though. Point two might be enough. Yep, we got it. And then we'll just use the last little bit on these little window frames. We're out. Back to the tedium of this gun. This gun? This beam? This nozzle? I say it's tedium. This is the fun. This is the game. But there is something very, very satisfying about completing something using the cleaner, the soap. You know, I don't want to do everything with the soap. Do I? Maybe I do. Speedrun. I still haven't looked up any speedrun strategies. Who knows? Maybe there's something fundamental that I'm missing. You are actually just supposed to use soap every time you can. And by not doing that, 
I am a fool. <laughs> Maybe it's that simple. I am a fool for not utilizing the tools given to me and instead choosing the harder path. Choosing it. But whatever. You know what? As long as I'm enjoying it, it doesn't matter if I'm doing the foolish thing. Maybe I want to do the foolish thing. Maybe it's more satisfying to see things get cleaned slowly. Am I just standing in a urinal? I sure am. It's the only way to clean these lights. I don't know what Clement Weathers is talking about. Cistern. There we go. And I was wondering when I was going to finish that. Oh no, I'm crouched in. Get out of there. I was crouching in the urinal. Leave a comment. Let me know if this is. if you've ever seen urinals of this style. Because I don't think I've ever seen jumbo urinals like this. Also, is this just like a. Anybody can use this washroom? Because it's got urinals and stalls. Are the urinals... They're not on both sides, though. Yes, they are. How does the bathroom even work? This is a weird bathroom. I don't like it. Alright, looks like the, the hardest part to miss is underneath the rim here of this urinal. So I'm just going to make sure that I get these now. So not to forget about it later. There's a gnome painting. Some of these are worse than others. Why is this one so bad, so rusty? What happened here? <laughs> a mystery for the ages. Just jumping around like an absolute madman, trying to clean these. Yeah, the back is going to be the other part that ends up evading me. So let's make sure that we're focused on it. So it can't be. Let's get this pipe too. Looks like it's rusty. You don't got that out of the way. That's one less potential problem. Silly lights. <laughs> See, if I want to get this pipe clean, I have to stand in the urinal. It's very awkward. I also need to be able to do it to clean the space underneath the pipes. Was I not in a... Oh, there we go. We're fully in this urinal. Can't even really get behind this one. Whatever. Maybe that's something that we have to come back to. Nope, never mind. We finished the pipe. Oh, we already did that. <laughs> I was gonna go and clean in the underside, but that's done. It's the top that's gonna be the troublesome parts. If only I was ever so slightly taller. <laughs> Okay, the top is separate, actually, so that's good to know. We'll get that after, then. I love how the little urinal drain is its own separate piece, and it always gets clean really quickly. And we still have to clean the, the actual toilet stalls behind us, too. What did I miss here? Nothing. It's perfect. Just don't turn around. We'll never know. No, it's the wall. There we go. I thought it was the window frame that was still dirty over there. Moldy ceilings. Very gross. Is this place underwater? Why is it so bad? Why is it so dirty and moldy? And mossy? It's a secret bathroom? 
It was probably lore that I just didn't read. So I'm lazy. There we go. The ceiling is done. By the way, we've turned around, unfortunately. Now we can see this mess. This will have to get clean. And it will be as... daunting a task as it looks like it will. <laughs> I'm sure. Let's try and get these lights clean at least. They don't actually provide additional light in the area when they get cleaned, I don't think. But it still feels like they do, so that's good enough for me, even if it's not real. I'm okay with the placebo effect. Beautiful, clean light conduit. There's a lot of graffiti in here. One. What's wrong with this one? Oh, of course. <laughs> it's hard to remember that you gotta get things from all angles in three-dimensional space. Now this is, there we go. I was about to say, the ceiling panel's pretty much done. I don't know what's left. And then it finished. These sinks are going to be easier than the toilets, and they're still causing me problems. Actually, maybe they're not going to be easier at all. We know that there's a little bit of difficulty cleaning inside of these basins. So maybe this is to be expected. Uh, and then they all start dinging. Never mind, it was easy, actually. Oh, the faucets are separate? That's news to me. And a new problem to me, too. Hello, be finished. There we go. Ah yes, the other side that we barely touched. Have we even finished the urinals on this side? I don't think we are. No. Now they're clean. Now we just gotta do the toppers. And apparently this arch isn't done yet. Where have I missed it? Oh, that's obvious. Never mind. Dumb questions. You know what? Let's do this floor. I can already see dirt that's getting left behind. No. I hope it just doesn't matter. Also, things are getting clean anyway, and I don't even know what they are. What are they? Oh no, look at this. How are we leaving behind so much? We're very close. I say we're very close. We're starting to move toward being able to get that final power washer. Let me make sure that we aren't able to just get it. I think it's... N oh, it's 5,000. Never mind. We can get it. <laughs> We've been dumb... And then equipment, we can probably afford a bunch of that stuff now. Okay, I can't afford all of the extension nozzles, but probably don't need them. This is going to be way more powerful now. Watch this. We're not going to be leaving anything behind. We could probably even go to the white one. Maybe not. Yeah, maybe we should stick to what we know. Oh, you know what? Maybe we should equip it. There we go. Ooh, new sounds. It's very pretty. Look at it, it's so pristine and clean. Brand new. Oh yeah, we can get the rust now with this nozzle. We don't have to switch. One of these basins is still not clean. Which one? I think it's the third one. Or the middle one? I don't even know. Look at it. It looks beautiful and clean. Oh, wait. They're all clean? 
Is it just the wall then? Oh, yes, I think it is. Oh, there we go. That's where it is. Perfect. Beautiful. Floor's still dirty. Oh, I see this part. The urinal ledge is a different piece. Did we finish these? Yes. We didn't finish this wall, though. Try and get the outside of this frame. Those hinges are their own separate pieces, which means they probably have a back too that needs to be cleaned. That's okay, we'll get there when we get there. That wall's done. This archway is sturdy still. Very much so. Didn't see what that said, but there were clearly words there, and now they're gone. <laughs> I was in the zone. It was zoned out. It happens. Forgive me. Actually, you can rewind. Maybe you'll catch a glimpse of it before it disappears. These stalls are maybe not going to be as bad as I remember. Honestly, I think maybe this room used to be bugged when I did this once. I feel like there was a corner that I couldn't reach or something. Hmm, I don't know. We'll, we'll see if we hit it again. I did get it done, though, so maybe that was just user error. Which wouldn't be too big of a surprise. I just wasn't doing it right. Ew. The other side of this toilet. It's very hard to clean, even with the stubby gun. can't even stand up when I'm back there like that. <laughs> Hopefully this will just be good enough. Uh-oh. There's a tiny little speck still somewhere. There we go. Oh, thank goodness. How about this? Is this clean? The toilet seat? Yes. Good. Good, good. I don't want to have to deal with that again. Alright, back wall is clean. There we go. Get these door hinges too while we're in here. This stall's very nice now that it's clean. Mostly clean. Let's finish it. Here we go. Is that pipe clean? No. It's not even a pipe. It is a light conduit. Don't be silly. Oh, I'm seeing little specks out here. There we go. Just casually tap and tab. Every once in a while you catch a little speck of something. Oh, that was an accidental clean. Very nice. Oh, that door hinge is already clean. Okay. Even better. The silent dings. Whoops. <laughs> I've accidentally walked out of the stall. It's always the corners. There we go. I think this stall is done. Oh, oh. Now it is. Maybe not. Alright, that's as clean as that's gonna get. There we go. 
Do I have to do that for both of these? No, these are already clean. In fact, is this whole half done? Yes, I think so. We'll find out in the end. Can I pick this guy up? Alright, dude. You can chill over here in the sink if that's alright. I gotta clean the toilet. So awkward trying to get into the little crevices here. There we go, we don't need to. Good. Alright, we know the crevices are going to be a problem. Let's just get them out of the way. By crevices, of course, I mean corners. Ninety-four percent. We're making fine time. And this is still taking about an hour of my time. Maybe not. Maybe forty-five minutes. But that's not bad compared to the treehouse, which I think was an hour and a half. Oh boy. Yeah, this is definitely faster. Oh, there we go. Ceiling's done. Oh yes, the other stall. Oh, we also missed. Oh, never mind. Somehow managed to just accidentally finish all of that right away. No little dude in the toilet this time. That's nice. Thank you for finding somewhere else to go. I don't need to be under there spraying <laughs> directly over my head. Alright, we are almost done here. It's like 1%. But we're still not getting the notice. Oh, there we go. There's some little cracks there. Oh, there's a little bit of that wall that was easy to find. The ceiling's still not clean. Looking for the obvious ones first. That looked like it was obvious, but then there was not really anything there. Oh, hello. A lot of these urinal spreaders are the messy ones. The ones over here are all clean, I think. This one's not. Now it is. I think we might have to go to the... iPad for this. The iPad, the tablet, whatever it is. Yeah, look at that. Cistern pipes. That's gonna be for one of the toilets, isn't it? Nope, oh, I saw a cubicle wall that wasn't clean too. Oh, is this the same one that I fumbled on? The first time I did this level and got stuck in here trying to clean? I think it might be. I think there's like a piece of this wall behind the geometry or something. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> maybe I imagined that problem. Oh, it is that pipe. Hmm. Well, very obvious, actually. Cubicle door frames. They should blink for me. Yep. Oh, yes, I see it. And then that toilet seat, or is that the toilet itself? It was the toilet itself, it's now clean. The cubicle walls, there's still a bunch of them. Why don't I see it flashing though? Oh, it's this one, the very back wall. Is this the one that gave me trouble? Because it does look very clean, doesn't it? It's behind the pipe. We're in the crevice of the cistern. Yep, it's done. Door hinges, three. Easy fix. Done. 
cubicle walls to mushroom walls. I don't even know what a mushroom wall is. I need to find the last of the cubicle walls, though. So is it a lie when it says that the cubicle walls are the problem? Nope, I do see a washroom wall that needs cleaning. But where? Probably behind the cistern? Yes. Alright, where are these last two cubicle walls? These are washroom walls. There isn't another section. No. Well, this is a mystery. Oh, there we go. Okay, I understand. This might be the cursed wall. Because how am I supposed to clean this any better? Hello. Is there like some little, oh, some little crevice? Sure. I bet it's this one. It is, and I'll bet it's some little crevice. All right, we're done. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button, leave a like, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of our clean bathroom. And of course, if you enjoy these kind of videos, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, turn on the bell for notifications, look how clean that is. I love the part, we're gonna watch that one more time. Because right over here in this sink here, the little gnome shows up. <laughs> and I think it's the funniest thing ever. Alright, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Goodbye for now.